declining a settlement at ESPN over free speech. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel. Hit that like button, hit that notification button, but also comment on this video. Stage Seal has been at ESPN for over 10 years. She's one of their best reporters over at ESPN, but her biggest problem is that she happens to be conservative. She happens to be believe in free speech, and that's her biggest downfall. So ESPN decided to shut down her free speech when she refused to take the jab. They went after her. They threatened to suspend her like they did anybody back in that time who didn't want to take the jab. So now they come with a settlement offer of $500,000. Say still declines that offer and says you should give me more. And I truly believe she said it's not enough money for your constitution right, constitutional right for free speech. And she's correct. See, we ain't living a day today. If you don't say the proper pronouns, you get shut down. If you don't believe in all these different genders, you get shut down. Your free speech is shut down. And see, that's what the progressives, Democrats, and the liberals want. They want to shut down free speech. But that's what America is based on. Your First Amendment right is free speech. And you should have it at all times. I remember a time in America when liberals used to fight for WS organizations to have free speech. Now they don't want you to have free speech on anything. They want to shut you down. And this is what Sage Steel is fighting for. She's not the most popular person over at ESPN because many of the people over there are leftists, starting by the head in which she complains that Disney was shutting down everybody's free speech. So we should applaud people like Sage Steele who are standing up for free speech because many Americans are extremely scared after you seen what the FBI did to parents at school board meetings or how they did people at abortion clinics, this is terrorizing the public from free speech. So we should be happy that we have someone in the sports media who still believes in free speech. If she happens to lose her job in the near future, because you know that ESPN this week are having huge layoffs. So we don't know who they are going to lay off, but they probably won't lay off Sage Steel for the simple fact litigation is still going on. But this girl is a bright star at ESPN. She's been there for many a years. She's good at what she does. She's not fake. She's not phony. She gives you how she feels. And that's a good thing in this country because a lot of people are extremely scared. I want to thank you for listening to Black Side Sports This Quick Take. I hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.